GFCI stands for Ground Fault Circuit Interrupter. A ground fault is any time electricity strays away from its normal wiring path and tries to find a place to ground. Ground faults are especially dangerous in areas of high level of moisture, like a bathroom or a kitchen. Let's take this toaster for instance. If this toaster were to get knocked into a sink, a GFCI outlet or breaker would sense the imbalance in the circuit and shut the power off immediately to prevent serious shock. So here's the big question. What's the difference between a GFCI receptacle outlet in the wall or a GFCI breaker in the electrical panel or breaker box? GFCI outlets are generally used instead of standard outlets because they provide protection at a single outlet. That's called single location protection. However, they can be wired to protect themselves and other outlets running downstream on the same circuit. That's called multiple location protection. GFCI outlets are easy to test and reset if they trip, because you do it right there at the outlet. It's as easy as pushing your test button and then reset button and looking at the indicator light. GFCI circuit breakers protect the entire circuit. That means it provides protection against any ground faults with any of the outlets or wiring with that circuit. Some GFCI circuit breakers show you their operating status at a quick glance. If the GFCI circuit breaker trips, the indicator will change color. If you're trying to decide whether to use a GFCI outlet or GFCI breaker, consider this. If the circuit serves both lighting and outlets, but only the outlets need GFCI protection, like a bathroom, a GFCI outlet will serve just fine. But if most or all the appliances on the circuit need GFCI protection, like small appliances on a kitchen counter, go with the GFCI breaker.